Did the Genesis flood of 2350 BCE happen? Not according to the evidence. Almost no seeds from land plants can survive immersion in brackish water for a year, so after the flood there would be no way to quickly repopulate the land with plants. Consequently, there would be little food or habitats to support ecosystems for thousands to millions of years. The amount of sedimentation needed in the floodwaters to account for all the sedimentary layers being laid down at once would have killed virtually all aquatic life, including mangroves, seaweed forests, and slow-growing coral reefs that many marine species rely on. Little of the remaining life would have been able to survive the radical changes in water salinity. Tree rings show a tree's growth over a year. By counting the rings, it's possible to determine a tree's age to an exact year. The oldest living individual tree, a bristlecone pine in California, has a confirmed age of over 4,855 years. That's at least 480 years older than when the flood supposedly occurred, an event that would have destroyed the tree.